Colorado, although based in the north of Scotland, continually travel the world with their brand of gospel country music. They've appeared with many of the big names in the American scene, Boxcar Willie, George Hamilton IV, and Melba Montgomery. But now they're in demand in the States in their own right as Colorado. We've been over uh, twice last year. Um, we went to Nashville in June, and we were only about five weeks, I think, back in Britain when we were out again in Texas, and that was quite an experience. Um, in fact, on the night that we arrived in uh, Dallas, uh, we stayed in a super big hotel, and it was all very impressive for sort of North Country boys. Um, and on the first floor of the hotel, um, there were two massive ballrooms, over on one side was the Miss Texas competition. And uh, I think, uh, you know, every girl looked like she just walked out of a fashion magazine. Incredible. And on the other side, uh, there was a gay convention going on. So during the interval, they all got together and started looking at each other and saying, you know, well, my dress is better than yours and whatnot. It was an amazing experience for us. I couldn't believe it. So I called uh, the boys uh, in, to their bedroom and uh, I said, look, you better come down and see this, because if I try telling you tomorrow, you're just not going to believe me. And uh, a guy came down with them in the elevator, and uh, he was wearing the sort of leather straps and the little <laughs> leather hat and everything. Incredible. Country music was the boom industry of the entertainment scene, with clubs springing up in virtually every town and community in Scotland. Colorado rose on the crest of that phenomenon, and have built successful careers out of it. But is there any sign that that boom is now on the way out? I think the, the interest in country music is still strong. The support for the country music clubs up and down Britain uh, has diminished quite a bit. A lot of groups, good groups, have fallen by the wayside. Um, we're fast becoming veterans, I think. But uh, certainly in the north, it's still quite strong. You know, Inverness, Aberdeen, and uh, places like that are doing quite well.